Hi friends, so this video shows how to set up a race port C using Nginx. So let me uh, list all open ports in this server sudo net stat hyphen top line. You can see port 80 is open. So let me access this port 80 and see what is. Uh, running there uh, in port 80 i can see the default uh, page of uh, engineers i can access there so there is no other configuration this is a fresh installation of nginx that is why uh, we are seeing the default welcome page of engineers here so if you if you go to this slash etc engineers site and find available slash default there you can see the default configuration you can see uh, it's listening uh, to port 80 and and the root folder here so the, that is why we are seeing that welcome page there so what i'm going to do is i'm going to change this port uh, to some other number because i'm going to use this port let me check it to uh, 8005 then save it uh, then uh, restart nginx then let me check the open ports now you can see 80 is not open and you can see 8005 is there there i you can find the default uh, nginx welcome page so now i'm going to add new configuration so here you can see I am going to create a new file under etc nginx site available. The file name is my app. So let me create it. Then in that file, I am going to add these lines. I am going to listen on 80. Then the server name you can give some name there. Then the location slash this line is important so so whenever i request uh, come to this uh, port 80 i'm telling this redirect that request to uh, port 8100 so basically it will redirect the request coming to port 80 to 8100 so there should be some service uh, running in our system in this system in port 8100 So let me uh, save this file. So if you okay. after creating this file and a site available, if you uh, restart uh, nginx and check open ports you will not see that port 80 right here because there is one more thing you have to do you have to create a symbolic link like this from site available uh, to site enabled so you have to create a symbolic link like this so let me create it then restart uh, nginx then check for open ports See now you can see port of the H zero is open. The program engine is actually is listening to port H zero. So now at it, in this situation, let me access port H zero from a browser and see what is what is showing. So you will you will get this error eight five zero two bad gateway. So you are getting that Pfizer to bad gateway because as per our configuration there should be some service uh, running on port listening on port 8100 in this system but right now there is nothing listening on port 8100 so let me uh, uh, run, uh, run, let me run some service so here i have created a uh, application using ionic uh, framework so i am going to serve uh, that application 
ionic uh, serve command so when I run ionic serve you can see it's internally it's running ng run app colon serve then host this one and port 8100 so now we can see it's listening to this port 810 so now both 8100 at port 80 port are open in this system now if i access that port 80 that request should redirect to this port and i should see this app so let me refresh this page you can see now it's redirecting i can see this uh, app here in this machine so same thing i can see here if i directly access this 8100 port i will get the same page because that port also open in that server you can uh, you can see that from port 8100 i am getting uh, this page from port 80 i am getting the same page so when when i send a request to port 80 the nginx reverse proxy will redirect that request to port 8100 that is why in here i am getting this uh, page so this way we can do uh, reverse proxy using nginx so when you do this configuration in production you have to uh, disable the uh, remote access to this port this port should not be accessible from the from outside okay so you will uh, make only h0 is accessible from the outside i hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel please like and share the video if you have any doubt please comment so if you want to uh, remove this configuration you can just uh, remove this file sudo Error. my app then uh, restart nginx so if you are getting this type of error that is because of the symbolic link which we created we have to delete that symbolic link also so you have to just copy this file and then change it to uh, site enabled Okay, then restart the nginx now it's working so please subscribe my channel please like and share the video